always fun things to do. <laughs> a Fei Fei's recommendations from what to buy from a Thai 7-Eleven. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I haven't made videos in a long time, but I'm gonna start making videos again. So I'm currently in Sakeo, which is my friend Fei Fei's hometown here in Thailand. And this will be my first video showing around what's going on here. Um, she's planned so much and has gone above and beyond with her um, hosting as showing me around her hometown, met all of her friends, met her parents. It's been great. I filmed a lot of it, so I hope you'll enjoy it. But first things first, before arriving to Thailand, I need to get there. Here I am at the airport in Taipei, taking the flight to Bangkok, and I'm pretty excited to finally go on a, a long trip. I've been planning this for quite a while. Welcome to my first full day of travels. Um, so I had a good like, five hours of sleep. Um, arrived pretty late last night yesterday to Bangkok. And now I'm walking to the bus station or the van station to catch a bus to Sakeo, Fei Fei's hometown, to go see her. So I'm super excited about that. I'm meeting up with Fei Fei's friend and we're going there together so that's nice I don't need to worry about things too much um, but yeah it, we're taking the first first bus which leaves at 7 a.m. so we're meeting at 6 6 30 <laughs> which is why the Sun isn't really up yet well, that's all right you know better to get an early start for the day and we'll arrive in Sakeo at a decent time and then we'll be able to enjoy the full day. I had no plans for today, but Fei Fei never fails to disappoint. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> always fun things to do. <laughs> Whoa!
How was cool. this? It's more difficult than I thought. <laughs> or maybe I just don't have talent. Yeah. Almost straight from wakeboarding. Um, Feifei's day plan of the day is going straight to a market. Yeah. Yeah. It's good, there's no time to get bored. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> what is it? Gali up. Gali up. By the pin. By the pin. Do you want to explain what the market has? I think every country food already here. We have like pizza from Italy, already have like sushi from Japanese, Japan, here. And the salmon from Korea, already here. Mm. So they've got everything. Very yes. comprehensive list of food. Mm -hmm. Ten baht and five baht also have. Do you smell something? Something good? What is it? Pala. So what is this? Yawalaya. Mupala. 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 And what is that in English? English are pork stick. <laughs> pork stick. Good. <laughs> okay. We use the corn and sugar and the butter together, like sweet together, like that. The flavor is like sweet. The bed one. Mm -hmm. Here they are. So after having a bit of a rest, well needed rest, I'm heading over to Fei Fei's Korean restaurant. So she just recently opened a restaurant here in her hometown, which is very very exciting. Um, so we're gonna spend the evening there. So today's specialty is silkworms from the market. It's pretty good. Kind of tastes a bit mushroomy, but also like a like like a bug. We had such a good time yesterday at Fei Fei's restaurant. Like she really knows everyone around here, knows how to get a village together. So that was great. All of her friends were there. I got to learn quite a lot of new Thai phrases, some good, some bad. Um, do I remember any of them today? We'll, we'll see. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go grab something from the store real quick. And then I'm gonna meet Fei Fei later on and we're, we have a fun, exciting day planned ahead. What are we doing? We go to look a Lao temple mm -hmm. Why? with monk. Huh? Why did we come to the temple? Because we need to make a marriage, like do something good with 
มังพี่เมย์ทำมาเองนะอ๋อที่เขาบอกว่าพี่เมย์ cooking by herself and you can see the light from that one he go at the morning he go to every house and then some someone put like เบอร์เจคเค้กมันให้หวานอ่ะร้อยที่สองรอบรู้สึกไม่บุญหรือเปล่าขอจะแปะมาคือเพราะว่าเด็ก Mm -hmm. The temple mm -hmm. inside the cave. You don't want to go? Yeah, she's no good. I have to go. Go to like new coffee shop in Sakel. It just opened like January 11. Hanging out at the coffee shop and just chilling. We're now gonna go see some bats, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So there we have bat caves, and I'm not sure how much can be seen on camera, but the bats are flying out there, and it's just around sunset time that the bats fly out. What do you think about the bats? We're gonna, so we're gonna have Fei Fei's recommendations from what to buy from a Thai 7-Eleven. Now, yeah. okay, this one like uh, the bed one that I like is like the milk white milk white mom white mom milk. Yeah. But actually, I like all of this. It's very very nice and very cheap. You can see this one just twelve. Yes, yeah. six baht. And this one, 10 baht, you can see, yeah. And this one is like tomato, but so nice. And this one is like a chicken with sauce, and they have like a sauce inside. You need to dip 
before we eat. So what are we gonna have for breakfast? Yeah, it's like traditional for the kid, Thai kid. When we was young, it's like we will eat mu bing before we go to school because it's easy. Just pork, one kid pork and uh, sticky rice. Today we woke up early because we're here. What are we gonna watch? We're going to watch Miss Universe Final. Yeah, so we wake up early so we could all watch Miss Universe Final together. Me and Fei Fei uh, have not watched this so much before, but we have two big fans, so it'll yeah. be fun to watch with them. <laughs> so at 8 a.m., what happens at 8 a.m.? Uh, like every morning, 8 o'clock, we will always open the national song in the TV or radio. Yeah, so we just had some of the best Vietnamese style Thai food I've ever had. Not that I've had much of that kind of food before, but it was incredible. It was like this kind of um, lettuce wraps that has a rice paper on the outside and you could fill it in with all sorts of different herbs and, and garlic and meat and some sauce. It was super, super good. So we're at a border market between Cambodia and Thailand. So we're still in Thailand, but near the Cambodian border. And here they sell very cheap goods. So some of it is secondhand or vintage. Um, some of it was like vintage shirts that have been cropped already. So they kind of style it, I guess, and then resell it here. And some of it is just very cheap new products as well. So look around. Mm. Wow. 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 Two 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 dollar. Two dollars. Then it was time to say goodbye to Sakil and take a minivan back to Bangkok but this was not the end of my Thailand adventures so even though I was sad to leave Sakeo I was looking forward to the next destinations which I have filmed and the videos will be up someday when I edit them <laughs>